Just chilling now uh, before I get on the rollers uh, and get ready for the race. The course is particularly fast, uh, quite a lot of turning actually, so it ends up being quite a lot of accelerations. Um, there's a good sand pit, uh, straight, fairly tough sand pit, and a big lump of sand that you have to kind of ride halfway up and then ride down. Um, so yeah, feeling pretty nervous for this one uh, because. Uh, I'm in mean with the elites, and it's one of those races where it's just so tight you can get kind of left behind a bit, um, and it's quite punchy, so it doesn't quite suit me as much. Um, but we're gonna give it a good shot and um, yeah, see where we come out. In a bag. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Oh, I Yeah, it's Yay! Yeah. 
Keep it going. Yes, boy. Well done. Good race. De gasten wij staan de roeping, scherp te krijgen, je bent aan het uiteraard van hand op hand genodigd. Om straks de nummer 7, 2 en 3, het nodige applaus, de kunnen geven en de roeping, scherp te krijgen voor Kevin, Paul, de Schens, Adams. Goed gedaan. Goed face. Oh boy. Dat was right. Ja. Yeah. 27. That's a wrap on today. Uh, pretty good race at uh, Cedar Classic GP Hasselt. Um, I had a bit of an annoying start. I, I had a fairly good grid. I was like third row, second, third row with the elites. And I just mucked up a few little things and just got like like trodden on basically and mucked up. Um, so I was fair fair way back after one lap. I just started picking off people and made up some good time. The gaps ended up getting quite big and I lost the full duration, but I was like just about to be lapped basically. Um, so I raced for like an hour and seven minutes or something. So I just cruised around for the last lap or so and tried not to ruin myself for tomorrow. I finished 27th out of 50 odd guys. So um, almost in that top half, but yeah, not, not quite there yet. Um, yeah, maybe 14th uh, U23. Um, there's quite a lot of people weren't there this weekend because they're off training in sunny places um, So it's kind of hard one to judge um, but Yeah, so on to tomorrow in Mole uh, Leave tomorrow morning head down to the course See what's happening with the sand. It's gonna be a wet one tomorrow um, So the bikes gonna be pretty grimy and gritty uh, Going through brake pads and stuff, but yeah, should be good. So I hope you enjoyed this video remember to like and subscribe and um, yeah, stay tuned for the video coming from Zilvermere Cross uh, uh, in Malt.